Welcome to the SoftSafe Test Prep. This is the SoftSafe Alcohol Advanced Practice Test 2. We have gathered another 35 questions with explain answers. So let's get started. Question 1 Which of the following statements is the most acceptable? A. I am only doing my job. B. You shouldn't have any more drinks. C. You have had too many drinks tonight already. D. A company policy doesn't allow me to serve you another drink. And the correct answer is option D. A company policy doesn't allow me to serve you another drink. When communicating with customers who have been drinking and are getting too close to intoxication, Avoid you statements. Instead, state facts like our company policy says and it's against the law. Question 2. A customer arrived at noon. By 2 p.m., they have had three 5-ounce glasses of wine. How many drinks remain in their system at 2 p.m.? A. 1 B. 2 C. 3 D. None And the correct answer is option A. 1 By 2 p.m. the customer's liver, assuming it's healthy, has processed two drinks per hour, meaning one drink's worth of alcohol still remains in their bloodstream. Question 3 as you serve your customer a drink, you inform them in a professional and polite way that this is their last drink. You tell your manager and other staff that you have stopped service and they approve and provide backup. You offer the customer food and non-alcoholic drinks. Which action should have been done differently? A. You should have written an incident report. B. You shouldn't offer food when you know they will be leaving. C. You shouldn't inform customers when serving them a drink. D. You should have alternated between serving them alcoholic and non-alcoholic drinks. And the correct answer is option C. You shouldn't inform customers when serving them a drink. When it comes to ending service, you should never inform the customer when they are being served. Wait until they try to order the next drink to tell them service has ended. That way, they won't have time to grow angry or resentful during the last drink. Question 4. Which of the following is not considered a human cost of irresponsible alcohol service? A. Death. B. Fines. C. Physical harm. D. Debilitating injuries. And the correct answer is option B. Fines. Fines are a legal cost of irresponsible service. Debilitating injury and minor physical harm are human cost of irresponsible alcohol service, the worst of which is death. Question 5. Which of the following is not a type of liability that applies when serving alcohol? A. Civil B. Criminal C. Commercial D. Administrative and the correct answer is option C commercial. Liability or legal responsibility for what you do or do not do is important to understand when serving alcohol. This includes criminal, civil, and administrative liability. Question 6 Most companies have a policy against blank while working. 
A. Eating B. Sitting C. Smoking D. Drinking alcohol And the correct answer is option D. Drinking alcohol Alcohol can hinder judgment and lead to bad decisions So most companies have a policy against drinking while working Question 7 which of the following is not a reliable sign of intoxication? A. Becoming nervous B. Switching to large drinks C. Becoming careless with money D. Complaining about drink strength And the correct answer is option A. Becoming nervous Becoming careless with money Complaining about drink strength and switching to larger drinks are reliable signs of impaired judgment. You should talk to your customers if they begin to exhibit these signs. Question 8. Which of the following is the best food choice to slow alcohol absorption? A. Popcorn B. Vanilla cake C. Mashed potatoes D. Fried mozzarella sticks And the correct answer is option D. Fried mozzarella sticks High fat foods and high protein foods take longer to digest So fried mozzarella sticks are the best choice However, any food is better than no food when it comes to keeping alcohol in the stomach as long as possible Question 9. Which of the following is an example of a distillation? A. Wine B. Beer C. Vodka D. Soft drink And the correct answer is option C. Vodka Distillations are fermentations that have been distilled, removing water from the alcohol and making it stronger. Liquors and spirits are distilled. Question 10 How many standard drinks are in a 20 ounce pitcher of sangria made with wine and fresh fruit slices? A. 2 B. 4 C. 3 D. 6 And the correct answer is option B. 4 5 ounces of wine is considered one standard drink so a 20 ounce pitcher of sangrid made of wine and food slices will equal 4 drinks. Question 11. It will take a healthy liver blank hours to metabolize 6 drinks. A. 2 B. 3 C. 4 D. 6 and the correct answer is option D, 6. A healthy liver metabolizes about one drink per hour, so it will take 6 hours to process and metabolize 6 drinks. Question 12. Once alcohol enters the mouth, where does most of it go next? A. Brain B. Stomach C. Small intestine D. The bloodstream. And the correct answer is option B stomach. When alcohol enters the mouth, a small sum is absorbed into the bloodstream, but most does not. Instead, it moves to the stomach where a bit more alcohol enters the bloodstream through the stomach walls. It continues into the small intestine where most of the alcohol is absorbed. The bloodstream and quickly to the brain. Question 13 A scotch and cola with 3 ounces of 100 proof scotch is how many standard drinks? A. 1.5, B. 2, C. 2.5, D. 3. And the correct answer is option D, 3.
one ounce of 100 proof liquor is one standard drink. So, three ounces of 100 proof scotch will equal three drinks. Question 14. You have just added service to a customer. Which of the following foods will be best to offer to that person? A. Bread. B. Peanuts. C. Fried chicken wings. D. Pretzels with mustard. And the correct answer is option C. Fried chicken wings. Fried foods and foods high in protein are best because they take longer to digest and they keep alcohol in the stomach longer. Question 15. An intoxicated customer just left in their own car. You call the police. Which of the following is not something the police need to know? A. The car's description. B. The license plate number. C. How many drinks they had. D. What direction they were headed. And the correct answer is option C. How many drinks they had. You can't physically stop someone from leaving. So if an intoxicated customer drives home, even after you have tried to discourage them, call the police immediately with the make and model of the car, license plate number, and the direction the customer was headed. Question 16. You have ended service with a customer who was otherwise calm and quiet. Which of the following is not a good next step? A. Offer the customer food. B. Ask the customer to leave. C. Offer the customer a soft drink. D. Offer the customer a glass of water. And the correct answer is option B. Ask the customer to leave. Once you have ended service, offer the customer a non-alcoholic drink or some food. The longer they sit there not drinking alcohol, the more time the blood has to process the drinks they have had. Question 17. What is the purpose of a jigger? A. To order drinks. B. To measure drinks. C. To read magnetic stripes on ID cards, D to measure intoxication levels in customers. And the correct answer is option B to measure drinks. A jigger is a tool used to measure drinks. Measuring drinks properly helps prevent overpouring which leads to intoxication. Question 18. The penalty for Criminal liability can be blank. A. Prison. B. Closure. C. Lawsuits. D. Loss of your liquor license. And the correct answer is option A. Prison. Criminal liability can mean jail time, probation, or fines if specific alcohol service laws are broken, such as serving alcohol to someone under 21. Lawsuits and compensation are the result of civil liability and losing your legal license or being fined falls under administrative liability. Question 19. In most states, the legal BAC limit to drive is blank. A. 8.0 B. 80.0 C. 0 0.8 D 0 0.08 and the correct answer is option D 0 0.08 BAC measures alcohol in the blood research indicates motor skills are significantly impaired at a BAC of 0 0.08 and all states have set the legal intoxication limit at 0 0.08 Question 20. Which of the following is not a sign of 
relax inhibitions a a customer using foul language b a quiet customer becoming loud c a customer making rude comments d buying drinks for everyone in the bar and the correct answer is option d buying drinks for everyone in the bar someone becoming careless with money is a sign of impaired judgment customers who become overly friendly or unfriendly depressed quiet or loud make rude comments or use foul language are showing signs of relax inhibitions these are all changes in behavior that should be observed by alcohol servers question 21 which of the following is something a valid id must have a microprinting b textured edges c color change features d the owner signature and the correct answer is option d the owner's signature a valid id must have the owner's photo and an expired date the owner's birth date and the owner's signature and it must be intact question 22 a statement like you have had enough to drink is known as a blank statement and should be avoided a u b true c quick d liable and the correct answer is option a u u statements should be avoided because they can sound judgmental often or in white argument instead state facts like it's against the law for me to continue serving you Question twenty three: Which of the following best represents something you should do to try to prevent an intoxicated person from driving? A. Hide their car. B. Block the door. C. Take their keys. D. Inform them you are going to call the police. And the correct answer is option D. Inform them. you are going to call the police you can't physically stop someone from driving instead try to convince them not to drive warn them that if they drive you will be calling the police you may take their keys only if they offer them to you question 24 Do you witness a customer in your establishment selling drugs? What should you do? A. Ask them to leave. B. Inform management. C. Wait until something happens. D. Inform the customer that what they are doing is illegal. And the correct answer is option B. Inform management. Illegal activities like gambling, prostitution. Lewd behavior, selling drugs, or using weapons must be addressed. But keep safety in mind. The best choice given for this situation will be to inform management. Let them decide what to do next, which may involve calling the police if necessary. Question twenty-five: In which of the following scenarios would A server not be held liable. A. Serving alcohol to a large group. B. Serving alcohol to a known alcoholic. C. Serving alcohol to someone who is visibly intoxicated. D. Serving alcohol to someone who is passing it to a customer under the age of 21. And the correct answer is option A. serving alcohol to a large group serving alcohol to someone visibly intoxicated a known alcoholic or someone who is passing alcohol to an underage customer could result in the server being held liable question 
which of the following best represents an empathetic statement to use when stopping service? A. I am sorry if this upsets you. B. I am sorry. You can't have another. C. I am sorry. You are causing a scene. D. I am sorry. You are breaking the law. And the correct answer is option A. I am sorry if this upsets you. When stopping service, it's best to communicate to your customer in an empathetic way that avoids judgment. Empathy lets the customer know you understand their feelings, avoid use statements that imply judgment, and instead use phrases like, I am sorry if this upsets you, or I am sorry but I can't serve you another. Question 27 Which of the following best represents our statement that expresses concern? A. I am just doing my job. B. I am just following the rules. C. I am just trying to be responsible. D. I just want to make sure you get home safely. And the correct answer is option D. I just want to make sure you get home safely. Communication is important when stopping service, but showing empathy along with expressing concern helps avoid arguments or offense. Show genuine concern for the customer's safety by saying, I just want to make sure you get home safely instead of, I am just doing my job. Question 28. Which of the following best represents our statement showing firmness? A. Okay, just one more. B. Okay, a weaker drink. C. Okay, but this is the last one. D. I am sorry, but I could lose my job if I keep serving you. And the correct answer is option D. I am sorry, but I could lose my job if I keep serving you. It is important to remain firm and not back down when refusing service. If you do not, you can teach customers to disrespect you, your establishment and the law, which makes ending service even more challenging in the future. Remain firm and say something like, I am sorry, but I could lose my job if I keep serving you. Question 29. Which of the following actions is least likely to inform you of a customer's potential for violence? A. Telling jokes. B. Making threats. C. Being overly animated. D. Inappropriate sexual contact. And the correct answer is option A. Telling jokes. Always observe customers to anticipate potential violence. Keep an eye out for loud, unruly, overly animated, or overly emotional customers. Customers making inappropriate sexual or physical contact. Customers making threats or arguing, or customers throwing chairs, glasses, or other items. Question 30. A company policy may include calling the police if you see a customer with a blank. A. Gun. B. Minor. C. Fake ID. D. Expired credit card. And the correct answer is option A, gun. In some states, you can lose your legal license if you knowingly allow someone with a gun to enter your establishment. If you see a customer with a gun, don't confront them. Inform your manager and follow company policy. Some state and local laws may include calling the police. Bringing a minor in may result in calling your manager, but not the police.
Question 31. When offered a bribe to continue service, which of the following actions is least likely to be appropriate? A. Alert co-workers. B. Inform management. C. Respectfully decline. D. Fill out an incident report. And the correct answer is option D. Fill out an incident report. While it may be an establishment's company policy to fill out an incident report, this is the least necessary action to take in this scenario. Always respectfully decline and inform management and co-workers if a customer bribes you to break the law and continue service. Question 32. It's a best practice to blank when counting drinks a guess b round up c not worry d round down and the correct answer is option b round up counting drinks is the best practice to keep up with how much alcohol a customer has had it is also a best practice to round up when counting drinks to ensure a more accurate count especially if the customer is drinking mixed drinks and the specific count may be more difficult to tally. Question 33. If you are required to blank, you should be trained properly to pour. A. Free pour. B. Dark pour. C. Quick pour. D. Silent pour. And the correct answer is option A, free pour. A free pour means you do not use a jigger to measure the amount of alcohol poured into a drink. In order to free pour safely and accurately, proper training must take place to ensure you are not overserving customers. Question 34. When are customers allowed to bring their own alcohol into an establishment? A. On weekends. B. During holidays. C. During special promotional events. D. Only when allowed by law and the company policy. And the correct answer is option D. Only when allowed by law and the company policy. Some establishments may allow customers to bring their own alcohol, but only when permitted by law and the company policy. Question 35. The most important thing you can do in alcohol service is to prevent your customers from becoming blank. A. Angry. B. Intoxicated. C. Dissatisfied. D. Disinterested. And the correct answer is option B. Intoxicated. As a server of alcohol, you are liable. So, the most important thing you can do is to ensure your customers don't become intoxicated. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, then please like, share, and subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to share it with your family and friends.